which you are you saving for? Which you are you investing for? It's a question I ask my clients all the time. Now think about it this way. There are two versions of you. First, there's the one that's watching this video right now. And then there's future you. Future you is the one that you're saving and investing for most of the time. But here's the thing. Future you wants you to save every last dollar that you have. Current you might want to get some chicken wings, might want to go on a vacation, might want to get the extra options on the car that you're buying. There's a balance between the two. You always have to be mindful of future you because he can't talk to you, but he still exists. And he wants you to put away money for the future because here's the thing, someday, God willing, current you is gonna become future you. And when you get there and you get to retirement, you're gonna have a finite amount of resources. The amount of resources you have are gonna be directly related to the decisions you make between today and that day. So keep future you in mind because He's gonna need that money. And a small change can make a huge difference in the lifestyle that future you is able to live. I'll give you an example. I'll put it up on the screen right here. If you put away $500 a month, you just started from zero and you put away 500 bucks a month and you earned an 8% average return over a 20 year period, it turns out to be over $286,000. $286,000, a lot of money. That's a relatively small change. $500 a month, certainly not nothing, but $500 a month is probably doable in one way or another, or some number close to it even if it's a hundred bucks a month small changes over a long period of time make a drastic difference and imagine being the person that retires with an extra three hundred thousand dollars by the way guys i'm antonio sabella i'm a financial advisor keeping the video short today but i wanted to have a conversation with you that i normally have with clients which you are you saving for? It's a really important topic, but it's something that a lot of people don't think of. I hope you enjoy the video. If you do, subscribe to the channel. Come on back, check out some of our other stuff. Be mindful of future you. Now that doesn't mean stay in your house and keep the lights off because the electric bill and don't have cable because there's a, you gotta live your life today. But you also need to take those little extra steps to put money away for the future. Because as I like to say, when it comes to retirement, nobody's coming to save you. There's no major bailout when you're gonna to get to retirement. Somebody's gonna drop a $2 million check on your door and say, hope you have a happy retirement. It's gonna be what you've put away for yourself and what it's grown into. And that can be all the difference between having a fantastic retirement or having maybe just an okay retirement or maybe not even really being able to retire. It's all of the little choices that are made compounded over a long period of time. If you're interested about learning how little changes can make a huge difference over a long period of time, I got you covered. Click the video right there. I think I actually titled it how small changes, I don't remember. But anyway, it's up there, click that video.